Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Welcome to my another tutorial on Android app development. From now onwards, I will be starting a new series on uh, Android OpenCV. So I will be teaching you the basics of OpenCV and many other things. So in this video, I will be teaching you on how to integrate your uh, the Android OpenCV SDK in your Android project. So let's get started. As you guys can see, I have created the project in Android Studio. So now the first step is you have to download the uh, OpenCV SDK. Uh, here is the link. You can download it from here. I will mm, put the link in the video description. So as I have already downloaded the SDK, so now what I have to do is, is I have to go to File, New, and Import Module, and uh, I have to go to the path where I have downloaded the SDK here and click on SDK and click on Java ok next finish alright now as you guys can see there is an error so what you need to do is first of all you need to open your own build or gradle alright let me create all other things and what you need to do is go to project view and in here open open cv library 310 and in here click on build or gradle and you have to uh, select only this one uh, your default build or gradle file okay 23 in my case is 2325.0.2 all right minimum SDK version 23 target SDK version 23 all right so now I click on try again so now as you guys can see the error is gone mm. so now what you need to do is you need to go to uh, file project structure in here you uh, have to click on app dependencies and basically you have to add the module dependency here uh, ok and click on ok alright now the next step is you have to create a folder so right click on new folder JNI folder you have to click on change and change the name to JNI libs alright click on finish now what you need to do is you need to go to the folder where you have downloaded the SDK go to SDK native libs and download uh, copy these four alright and paste it in app JNI lips. Make sure you select this JNI lips. Okay, okay. All right. Now the uh, it's complete. Now what we need to do is we need to go to our local dot properties. In here we need to provide the NDK so you uh, in this case you have to download the Android NDK to use the OpenCV all right I will show you how you can download Android NDK as you guys can see you can download the NDK from here as I have already downloaded uh, in mm, let me show you Android Studio NDK so what you need to do is uh, you need to go write ndk.dir request to d slash double slash android studio double slash and what you need to do is you need to copy the uh, this link and you have to copy that alright So now the 
uh, last step here is what you need to do is go to your gradle.property file and in here use android dot use deprecated and dk equals to true so now <laughs> let me connect my android phone sorry uh, last step is we have to go to our project no android open our band dot activity file in here i need to avoid check if the berry is included successfully or not so in here what we need to check is if open cv loader dot installate debug toast dot make tag get application context loaded successfully let's show else i have to print that the libraries could not be loaded could not load error all right now i need to open the main activity main drag a button and you have to use the on click check all right now let me run the application okay let's see if there is an error or not i hope there is no error Open the visor app. In the meanwhile, so that I show you the output of my Android app. Oh no, there is. I guess there is an error. Maybe or maybe not. So, uh, as you guys can see, the application is running. When I click on new button, you guys can see loaded successfully wait i open the mirror go app let me connect my phone so that you see the output correctly why that is just a bad app for uh, to show on new button as you guys can see loaded successfully so if you like the video please subscribe to my channel thank you goodbye